Mick Hilkins outside uh, Carrow Road, West Ham Fair TV. Dom, stolen the park, really. Yeah, man, uh, cheered us all up. Cheered me up, definitely. I'm still I'm still hurting from Thursday. Um, it's been a tough week for everyone. All the fans, the club, going out of Frankfurt, very disappointing, heartbreak, really. We had a job to do today, and we did it, and we didn't really have to get our first gear. I mean, you can see why they're going down, but, you know, we have to beat what's in front of us, and we were brilliant today. They were excellent. Just a tonic we needed, you know what I mean? A bit of a painkiller. Yeah, I mean, look, we haven't had a chance to talk since Europe, of course, but, um, you know, it was a disappointing end to a good run in a competition. But a win today is, is a step towards putting it back in it, back in it next week. Because well, Man United have left the door wide open again. Yeah, listen, mate, I'll be honest with you, I, I can't, I don't... Oh, it's... Kiss a bite that. <laughs> um, yeah, I, to be honest with you, mate, I, don't, I, can't, I, can't see us, um, I can't see us finishing above United. Uh, Got to win both our games, and hope they look. You know, I, I think we'll get at least a point now for us. I can't see us getting anything against City. We don't really do well against Brighton. We're going to have to win both our games um, and hope that they don't win theirs. I think. Uh, well, yeah, if we win both our games, we're there. I think because we're three points behind them, we played one more game than them. But I can't see it happening personally. But you know, if we do, it's a bonus. But listen, you know, like getting Conference League after. Playing in Europe this season and you know getting that far with the, our paper thin squad, I think I, I would have taken that at the start of the season. Although it was bitterly, bitterly disappointing on Thursday, in the grand scheme of things, we've we've done well. We've done well. I mean, them, them players were good today. They, you know, it was very disappointing the way we, I think we sort of limped out against Frankfurt, and it was a sour end to what's been a memorable competition. But we we, we can hold ourselves high. We, we've done. Them players have done us all proud, and. Um, if we're going to do better in the Conference League, the Europa League, we all know what we have to do. It's a big summer ahead of us, for us. It's a really big summer ahead. It'll be important to get in a, you know, wherever you finish, is the better quality players you can attract as well. Yeah, of course, mate. I mean, you know, the, the, the thing with the Conference League, it's, it's a new competition. I mean, it is a bit Mickey Mouse when you look at it. It's, it's one of them cups where you start off, you're like, oh, can't be bothered to pay like fucking Lincoln Red Imps at home on a Thursday night. But the further you get there, it's like, oh, hang on, outsiders might have a chance of winning it. Like, you know, Roma and final final. It's a chance for it's a chance for clubs, mate. It's a chance for clubs. It's, it's a good it's a good platform to to spur yourselves on and. We, we shouldn't be turning our nose up at it, you know. Like all I've all I've known of West Ham is relegation fights, mid tables, you know, the old cup final in, the, in 2006. But you know, we can't take these things for granted. I mean, two years ago we were fucking, we come here and won four 0 and it kept us in the Premier League. We come here and won four 0 this year and it's taken us a step closer to getting in Europe for the yeah, second we're, season. We're about to pit Man United for fourth, and we've just six. gone out uh, six. Sorry. Uh, fourth, uh, and we've just gone out of the semi-finals of a yeah, European competition. Yeah, I, I, mate, I just said I can't see us finishing above United, but if we do, it'll be a bonus. And you know, but if we don't, it, it, it's a sense of like what if, I suppose, because you know, you look at the two games we played against United. If Noble scores that penalty, we hang on at Old Trafford. We're three points above them now, but it is what it is. You know, like seventh place, considering all all things this season, is still very respectful. And. Uh, I think we can be positive. Good performance today. Didn't really have to get our first gear, but a lot of players, you know, show what they can do when they're on it. Antonio, Ben Rama, excellent goal for the third. Uh, and a bit of luck with VAR, didn't we? But I do listen. I do think we need to sort a goalkeeper out. Poor from Fab, but he got away with it. But let's not go into that. It's four 0 clean sheet, bang, job done. Happy Sunday. Rub, you know, sort of cheers us all up after what's been a tough week. But here we go. Let's have a good end to the season. Cheers, mate. Thank no you very worries, much. Man. Cheers, pal. No Thank you.